Welcome everyone, here is how you use the always on display in your iPhone 14 Pro. So if you leave your device uh, without touching it, if you're on the lock screen, uh, you're going to see it's going to bring you to this always on view where the device uh, its brightness is slightly lower. Uh, you're going to see your wallpaper darker. You have the date, time and all of the widgets, which will update once every second. Now, if you're on the home screen, as long as you have inside of the display and brightness settings, the auto lock set to any amount here, then after waiting, you'll also be brought to the always on view. In a little bit, I will show you how to change the auto lock settings. So you know, if you're trying to skip back to the video where I'm showing that part, just don't worry, I'll show you how to change those settings in a little bit. If you click the lock button, regardless where you are in your operating system, you can see your device is now locked in the always on view. The same applies to the lock screen as well. It's going to lock back like so. If you would like to have the device automatically go back to the always on display, you do this by opening up the settings app. From here, you're going to find where it says display and brightness. You're then going to find auto lock, tap on this one, and then you can select how long it's going to take uh, with you not touching the screen for the device to lock. Me personally, I set this to never. On top of this, if you don't like the always on display, you just want to turn it off, tap on this toggle, and now when you lock your iPhone, the always on display is going to be turned off, okay? So you're not going to have any always on display. You know, even if the device goes into standby mode, it's going to lock, okay? So I'm just not going to touch anything. You have a couple of seconds here, it locks, okay? And the always on display is completely off. With that being said, Thanks for watching, see you guys later, bye bye.